Out here at the Grantsville City Hall, there's a statue and plaque for Hilda Anderson Erickson. It says that she was born in Sweden in 1859 and was the last surviving immigrant pioneer. In 1866, at the age of six, she crossed the plains with her family in the Abner Lowry Company. She married John Erickson in the endowment house in 1882. Soon after, the couple was called to serve an LDS mission among the Goshu Indians in Ibapai, Utah. Later, the couple homesteaded the Last Chance Ranch with their son Perry and daughter Amy. A talented seamstress, Taylor, and a licensed obstetric, Hilda was known as the doctor to many expectant mothers. After the ranch was sold, Hilda opened a store in Grantsville which she operated for 21 years. She drove her own car until she was 94, and at 99 flew to Nauvoo, Illinois to be honored by the Centennial Commission of Utah. Her return flight was the first passenger jet airplane to land at Salt Lake Airport. She passed away in 1968 at the age of 108. Kate B. Carter, in our Pioneer Heritage, said of Hilda, Probably no woman in our state has ever lived a more energetic life. This monument to a grand lady was erected by the Sons of Utah Pioneers to honor all Utah Pioneers. The sculptor was Peter Billerup. President James E. Faust dedicated this statue that stands in front of the Grantsville City Hall in 1997. Hilda Anderson Erickson was the last survivor of 80,000 pioneers who crossed the plains prior to 1869 by handcart or wagon.